When we are witnessing this massacre taking place now in Lebanon, this is terrible. This is unacceptable. But this didn't start today, yesterday, or the day before. This is unfortunately following this one year of genocide in Gaza. This is unacceptable. And it didn't even start at October 7th. This is going on already for decades. This is criminal. This is not only criminal according to international law, this is criminal according to Jewish law. Killing, stealing, oppressing an entire people. All of this is contrary to very basics of Judaism. It happens to be that the very concept of Zionism to build a Jewish sovereignty by human, by, by human power is in total contrast to basics of Jewish belief. We are in exile by divine decree. We are forbidden to fight to end this exile by any physical means or, or to fight any people. any nation. We they are required by our religion to be peaceful, loyal citizens in whichever country we live. This is how we lived in Palestine. This is how we lived in Lebanon. This is how we lived in many other countries. This is how we are supposed to act. Unfortunately, this movement of Zionism, this state of Israel is an embarrassment to Jewish people. Since since all of, all of these crimes are being done supposedly in our name, it's a desecration of God's name when the Jewish religion is being misused to justify justify all these crimes. The state of Israel does not represent all Jews and certainly their crimes are not condoned the in the Jewish religion. All of this has to stop. It has to stop for the sake of everyone involved. Unfortunately, we are witnessing this endless cycle of bloodshed where everyone suffers because of this occupation. The root cause to all of this is not the difference of religions. We had differences of religions for the longest time. It is the occupation of Palestine, the brutal occupation, the illegal Our occupation, the anti-Jewish occupation, which is causing so much death and destruction to everyone. This has to stop in its entirety. We hope that this stops peacefully with no more suffering of anyone because we had enough. We want to have this stop so we can see once again the beautiful peace. We have to think, contrary to mainstream media that tries to tell you that, uh, you know, this movement of Zionism is a Jewish concept fighting the enemies, it's we and them. This is not the case. Israel is torturing, harassing, imprisoning, uh, 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 detaining whoever stands in their way. If this is going to be Jewish people, they will harass our people as well. This is what happens with our people in Jerusalem and many other cities. When we stand, if we are silent, then it's fine. If we stand up and we raise our voice and we, we bring attention, to the crimes of Israel, then they will attack us, they will brutalize us. This is what we see on alternative media. You would never see that in CNN. You would never see it in mainstream media. You might see it in Hispan TV. You might see it in some honest alternative media that, that uh, uh, deliver to the people what journalism is supposed to be. And, and we need this honest journalism because people need to know better than this mass propaganda that drives all people blind support to the state of Israel. This is wrong. It's not only wrong, it's dangerous. And it's not only dangerous to Palestine, it's dangerous to everyone.